So which is larger? Which fraction here is larger? 3 fourths or 3 fifths? So we're going to look at two ways you can figure that out. First, we could find a common denominator. So if we can get this number to be the same, then we could just compare the numerator. Whichever numerator was bigger, that'd be the larger fraction. So let's do that first. So I know that 4 times 5, 4 times 5, that would give me 20. And 5 times 4, that would give me 20. And I'd have the same denominator. But I can't just multiply by 5. I need to multiply by 5 over 5 because this is equal to 1. So I'm not really changing anything. 3 times 5 is 15. 4 times 5 is 20. 3 fourths is equivalent to 15 over 20. So I have my numerator here. Down here, let's multiply the top by 4 and the bottom by 4. 3 times 4 is 12. And now I can compare these numerators here because I have the same denominator. And you can see 15 is larger than 12, so 3 fourths, that's larger than 3 fifths. We could also convert 3 fourths, or 15 twentieths, to a fraction. We end up with 0 0.75. These are equivalent fractions. Down here we could divide 3 by 5, or 12 by 20, and we end up with 0 0.6. You could think of it as 0 0.60 and clearly see that 0 0.75 is larger. So again, 3 fourths, that's larger than 3 fifths. This is Dr. B comparing the fractions 3 fourths to 3 fifths. 3 fourths, that's the bigger fraction. Thanks for watching.